Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Poigie here, getting ready to take out the Italian Reserve CR32 and Air Realistic. Um, we just came off a really good game in this thing. We had six air kills, 18 grounds, so I'm going to stop talking shit about it. It can do really well. Uh, the key to it is you're not going to be faster than any of the fast planes. You're going to be about even on climb rate and um, speed with most of the biplanes, but a lot of them can outturn you. You do have 250 cal, 700 rounds, which is huge. They hit hard, um, plenty of ammo. Um, but the key to this plane in ARB is to make sure that you get an energy advantage over your opponents before you get engaged. Otherwise, they can either outrun you or outturn you, depending on who you're up against. So having said all that, let's take it out and see what we can do. All right, the map's Tunisia. We've got stealth ammo, 800 meter targeting distance, minimum fuel load. I think this is a pretty small map, so we should get into it relatively fast. Hey, I hear some engines. Most of the games we've been playing are not full teams, so nice to have the potential to be on a full team. Or have a full game, I should say. You can tell by the takeoff run, this is not a fast airplane. like that we have the FTA on our side. There, go. there it is. That is by far my favorite, one of my favorite planes anyway. I've taken it up in jet battles uh, back before all the missiles and stuff and we've done okay in it. 50 cals hit hard, turns well. It's great in ground RB too. Alright, so we're going to take a left hand turn over towards the right side of their ground units. See what we're up against. So there are full teams, Germany, USSR, and China. Got three teams of two working together. These are squad guys, they're probably gonna be the most dangerous. They're on microphones and able to support each other. It's uh, hard to do a 1v2 fight. So we're just gonna continue to climb. Try to make sure that uh, that we've got an advantage when we come against the opponent. So by climbing like this and getting the energy, even if you come across a P-36, um, if you're ahead of him on energy, he can outrun you. Like, you can still catch him, and then when you do catch him, you can outmaneuver him. I mean, it's best of all worlds. So focus, focus, focus on starting off climbing on the maps. Best thing you can do. So far, PB-wise, do okay hitting bases. They can do a ton of damage. Well, let's see where our team's at. So most of them are behind or down to our right. If we get in trouble, we will duck right. Get some support. Get a mess too. We want to aim at them, actually. Whatever. Good choice. Doe's diving. So clouds. Interesting kind of best way to play clouds is to stay just underneath where you can still see them. You don't want to be too far into the cloud like we are right now where you can't see if somebody's coming for you. You want to stay just kind of below it so that you can push yourself up into the cloud if somebody, you know, unexpectedly gets a jump on you. Uh, it makes you definitely hard to find. All right, I-16, finally starting to see their fighters. So as always, we're gonna go for the highest one first. Right now it's that I-16 in front. Got two down to our left, which we definitely have the energy advantage on, but. Eh. Let's go for it. At least come back this way. Looks like that I-16 is going after our T2, so I don't want to chase them the entire map. I'd rather have a little bit of action. Not sure why our J8's having trouble with the I-16. He could definitely outturn them. The 16 has a great roll rate, but its uh, elevator's not very strong. 
All right, so rather than dive in early, we decided to do what we should do. Oh, hi, buddy. So always listen for engines. Let's go ahead and flip it. So we can't get a couple shots into them. Definitely got a shot into us. Couldn't get the nose around. Alright, so that's good enough is to push him down. Um, he's giving up a lot of energy right now going after our gladiator. We don't necessarily want to chase him. Here, a plane close that I don't see. It's got to be in the clouds. Here, I'm off to my right. Oh, there he is. Oof. We definitely don't want to get into it with an HE 100 with that much of an energy advantage against us. Let's uh, let's just make a run for it. I know I saw an I-15 up here somewhere. But yeah, that HE 100's playing his plane right, and that is not who you want to fight. You want to fight the guys that are playing their plane wrong. Alright, I 15, he could definitely outturn us, but he is out of energy and landing, it looks like. Now he's landing. Another I 15. It's low on energy. He's down. Just check around us. Gotta go back after that I-16 that tried to jump us. Let's get our speed up a bit. While we're heading that way, let's watch our radar. I-16 up there, looks like he's gonna wanna bounce us. is good. One hit. There we go. We're getting bounced. I can hear it. So it's got the energy advantage and got a much better roll rate than we do, but we can slow them down. We can outturn them. Let's just try and get our speed up best we can. So as long as we got him in a horizontal turn, he's going to be losing energy, which is what we want. He's down. Nice. Alright, so they're down to three. Not sure what the hell's shooting up the sky here. Let's see where we are on the map. So, HE-100 up above. Got a decent amount of ammo, but we're already pretty close to our airfield. I said we just go back there. Let that HE-100 spend some gas. Definitely going to keep our eye on him. does try to bounce us. Best thing to do is pretend like you don't see it until they're maybe a kilometer out or so, maybe 0.8, and then at that point do like a hard turn. So they're thinking, hey, easy target, he doesn't see me. We can avoid it. All right, we're going to repair, reload, refuel, check in with guys who are back in the air. I still like CR-32. We ended up with uh, four air targets. Let's see, good skill bonus for it. First place on the team. I think we got Terror of the Sky. We'll take it. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch you on the next one. America! Fuck yeah! To save this fucking day, yeah!
Beautiful.